Hey loves and welcome back to the channel guys. So today is officially New Year's Day. So happy New Year's to you guys. And um, I want to go to the Goodwill real quick. So basically I have dinner tonight. Um, so I didn't go New Year's Eve. But dinner is rescheduled for tonight. Um, so I want to go to the Goodwill to see if I can find like a little suit jacket. Because I kind of want to go for like a suit jacket and like um, like a little jean with like my little black boots. That's like the look I'm going for. So we're about to head out. Um, and go to the Google real quick. It is raining outside, so I just kind of want to hurry and get out because reservations are at 8 o'clock. Let's go ahead and get started. Oh, if you're new here, hi. <laughs> Do not forget to subscribe. And if you're returning, hey guys, welcome back. Let's go. girls we are back at the house and i'm about to make some little iced coffee real quick i'm so thirsty went in there bop 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 got out like y'all know me and that's only because i know my style and i know it looks good on me so it ain't take long at all i was shocked it was even open to be honest so my coffee that i get is actually unsweetened and then i put the creamer in there so Y'all yeah, still got the tree up in the back. <laughs> Is that ghetto? Still had a tree up after New Year's. So let me show y'all my jackets that I got because they are so far. When I just went to go get my SD cards, I went to Walmart and got some leggings. So I finally got some leggings, which I've been wanting for a while. And I got them in the extra large just because I wanted room. So I got some leggings first. Um, this is how they look. They got like the little band right here. And comment if you guys get um, leggings and stuff from Walmart because I know I do. But yeah, I got some little leggings and they come all the way down to the ankle. So I love these. And these will go real cute with um, with my little boots and stuff too. So these boots that I showed y'all is why I wanted leggings. You see what I'm saying? So yeah, these are the ones that I'm going to wear tonight too. This is like, uh, um, first off, it's a 16. And it's all black. Material is like a wool material. So, it actually fit me really cute. But this is how it looks right here. And like I said, it's like a wool material. This was the first one that I ended up getting, which I thought was really cute. And then it has like the little pockets on it as well. So, love that. This next one, y'all, right here. This is really cute. Um, the quality is really nice. I really love this one. Oh, it's a pocket. Oh, it's cute. It has padding in, in the shoulder, but it's not like overdoing it. I think this would be real cute over some jeans too as well. I'm going to bring y'all down here just so y'all can just get the gist of what I'm saying. So, pockets. It fits really well. Love the way it fits. You can tell it's just a really good quality. And it goes over my whole back and it has like these little like slits in it on the back as well. And I just love how this fit me. It's like an oversized jacket, honestly. Um, you know what? This could be a ladies jacket. It could be because it's, it's fitting me really cute. But um, pockets, detailing really nice. The material is nice. Really cute. So yeah, I want to try these on with some jeans 
and see how they look in my little boots for dinner tonight. Like I said, um, reservations are at eight o'clock. Then it has another button. Oh, this is cute. And if I button this up, yeah, this is a lady's jacket, I can tell now. This is a real statement. And then if I button this up, it'll really be like a fire little jacket. Oh yeah, this is real cute. Comment, let me know what you guys think about these jackets. I love these. But I wanna see how they look with some jeans real quick and I'm gonna show y'all. The look right here that I think I'm gonna rock tonight. Of course, I'm gonna do my ponytail and stuff over. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this look with the bag. Let me know. Definitely a look with the jeans and the boots and the jacket. This is definitely a look. Comment, let me know. I wanted to show y'all how this looks with um, the all black suit jacket. I like the all black suit jacket too though. What y'all think? Like this is really cute with the, this is cute. And then with the bag, oh yeah, this is given. So I'm like, should I wear this one or the black and white one? Cause I like this look too, with the bag. What y'all think? This one or the black and white one? Both is really cute though. Love this. Let me know what y'all think. This is cute. With the all uh, black, you, you know you can't go wrong with the all uh, black. With the all uh, black suit jacket, white shirt, boots. With the bag, really cute. Let me know what y'all think. And I'll probably put a belt with this too. But what y'all think? The all black suit jacket or the um, black and white plaid suit jacket? What y'all think? Cause the all black is just giving vibes. If I had like a little belt to go around here, it might be super cute with that too. But let me know, this is cute. I kind of like this look. And I kind of like it with the shirt. I ain't gonna lie. But let me know. I just wanted to show you this real quick because this is cute. Okay, I'm about to get ready now. <laughs> okay, guys, so we are dressed for tonight. I did go ahead and do the um, black suit jacket, and I am doing my New York Jones watch um, for rings. I think I'll do my black and gold ring. I did do the black jacket, um, white t-shirt from Target, and um, some blue jeans, and then like my boots. Perfume from tonight is going to be, mm, I want to do this Florenta Coconut. This is the Baccarat, and I ain't gonna lie, like it's giving Baccarat tonight. This is the Baccarat dupe, which is um, the Ambry Saffron by Dossier. Literally smell like money. So that's the perfume we're doing. Um, I got my ring on. I got my watch on. Um, this is the bag that we're doing, which is by Teddy Blake. Super cute. Um, and I think we're done. We're to go ahead and head out. 7.15, reservations are at 8 o'clock. But I think I want to leave a little early to take pictures. So, yeah. I will see you guys in a minute. Okay, guys. So, we are now in the car. And um, we are getting ready to pull up to the restaurant here in a minute. Like I said, reservations are at 8 o'clock. And it is 7.44. So, we are definitely on time. Um, I wanted to get there a little earlier um, to maybe like get like a picture for the new year. So yeah, I'll see you guys once we get there. I just want to check in with you guys.
It is officially a new day, the next day. Dinner was really cute last night, really enjoyed. Um, still cannot believe it's a new year, but I am cooking breakfast right now. Um, I'm doing like semi rolls, bacon, and some eggs and cheese. I already made some iced coffee this morning. I got the bacon right here. Cinnamon rolls are pretty much done. Got the cinnamon rolls right here. And I'm just going to put the icing on top of it. So this is how everything is looking before I put the icing on top. And then I got the eggs right here about to go in next.
hey guys and welcome to a new day i hope you guys are all having a good day today so i am dressed for today i will show you guys what i'm wearing here in a minute but guys today i want to go out find some more like beauty products um and then also i want to go look for some side tables today so i think i'm gonna go to the at-home store because today's monday and everything should be back open because i don't think it's a holiday but i want to go to the at-home store um i'm gonna stop at the goodwill again and then I think I'm going to go to like a, a Ulta Beauty or something to get some more products. So far, that's it for today. So, um, I am just for today. I have not did perfume for today yet, but I'll go ahead and show you guys the perfume that we're doing. This is the perfume that we'll be doing today. It smells really good. I got it from, um, I got it from Marshalls. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and do my um, watch right here. And then I think I'll put my little hoops in as well. Mm, that perfume smells so good. Yeah, I think I'll put my little hoops in as well. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and do these hoops right here, which are by, I think, Vince Camuto. Yeah. So guys, this is outfit of today. I got my boots that I got from Target, um, the leggings that I got from Walmart the other day, and then the sweater right here I end up getting from TJ Maxx that I hauled and I showed you guys. It's really cute. Um, and then also it can cover up your back as well. So I love that. Really cute um, ponytail today. Didn't do like any like curly like bangs, just kind of kept it simple for the ponytail. So it looks really cute though. Let me know what you guys think. So yeah, this is the outfit for today. And I think the bag I'll go ahead and wear is probably my Teddy Blake right here. I just think it looks really cute with it. Let me know what you guys think. And this is the bag that I'm thinking about doing. And then I'm thinking about going ahead and doing my um, maroon coat. So let's go ahead and get my coat so we can go ahead and head out, guys. So we are now in the car and we're about to go ahead and head out. It is a beautiful sunny day and I appreciate that because, oh, y'all see that sun? That's a lot of sun. But um, we're going to go ahead and head out, so let's go. Y'all seen the mirrors I got. I mean, the dressers I got. Um, I'm a little suspect about them. I'm going to tell you why. Because I feel like they like the one dressers. That I feel like everybody got. So I don't know how I feel about them. But we about to see. I'm sure you guys don't seen them before. But I'm going to try to put them up today. So let's go ahead and go. Okay, so y'all, we are now back at the house. Um, I did get my sushi. I've ate a couple pieces. I'm so hungry, y'all. Um, the dressers are actually outside in the garage. So I am going to pull those in real quick. Um, so I can just kind of place them where I want them. And then put them together. I think the whole thing is together. Um, the only thing I have to add is the legs. So 
let's go ahead and get these real quick. So, I think I want to take them in the living room and then try to unbox one. Okay, first things first, y'all. I'm going to just tell y'all. So, I am very on the fence about these, y'all. I'm sure you guys have seen these before. Um, let me know your honest opinion. Me, personally, <laughs> I don't know. I would have to see how they look once I um, put it inside the room. But, I'm going to go ahead and do a little unboxing and show you guys what we got. Okay, so, well, I basically got these on clearance. Um, these originally was $149, and they were on clearance for, I think, like 25% off. But I think it was higher than that because they ended up coming up to basically $112 a piece. So I was like, oh, this is a really good price. I would just really love if these was to work out. Especially for Mira, because we all know that Mira is very expensive. So the price was good. Um, the only thing I'm concerned about is if... Is if I like the style of it. Once I put it together. You know, because it's one thing looking at a picture on a box... But once you actually look at it, that's different. Okay, for example, these are the legs, which, okay. <laughs> I could tell it's okay quality. It is silver. Um, it is a silver leg and it has like the mirror inside the leg, okay. I'm gonna have to really see what the dress would look like because right now this is what it's looking like. Y'all, I'm nervous. And I'm nervous because y'all know I like my space to look very luxe and very just expensive. Like I do it on a budget, but it still looks expensive. You know what I mean? So I just don't want this to look cheap. Um, But the price and everything else just had me like, ooh, let's just see what it do. So, It looks like the part that's down here is actually the dresser itself. What is this? Did this gotta be put together? I am not putting this together. So this is number two, so something gotta be put together. I am not trying to put this together. I might have to wait for my man to get here to put this together because I am not in the mood for that. Oh, man, you got to put everything together? This is the the top part, I guess. I just I don't want to put nothing together. But this is the top part and how it looks. Okay, so so it says knobs shipped inside 
Okay, so this is the top part, which looks okay. Oh, hold on, is it? Hold on. Wait a minute. These are the instructions. I think the knobs are on the inside. I think the knobs are on the inside, but let me get this stuff out the way and let's try to get some coordination going on because y'all, this is just, this is kind of overwhelming for me right now. I'm not gonna hold you. Um, and I'm used to buying, well, not really, because the ones that I made for my black stuff, um, those were, I had to put those together by myself and my man wasn't there, <laughs> so I was pretty proud. But not only did I put it together, but I actually made mirrored side dressers. Now, I could have did the same thing this time, but y'all, I'm going to be honest. I didn't want to do that this time. So, I went ahead and just bought these. This is how it looks so far. Now, I will say quality is looking okay. Um, but let's go ahead and try to put it together real quick. Okay guys, so this is how the nightstands are looking right now. I am gonna put them on a side and see how they look. That's how the top of them are looking. I like them. Let me know what you guys think, but we're gonna go ahead and put them on the side of the bed to see how it looks. So guys, right here, I'm just taking the nightstands and putting them up under the mirror. I'm trying to figure out if they are a little short for the space but i do feel like once i put some lamps on here it will look more put together comment let me know what you guys think because this is how it looks so far with the mirror but i do think the mirror and the nightstands do kind of contrast with each other very well i didn't know whether or not if i wanted to get mirrored nightstands but now that i have them um they look pretty good and they don't look as overwhelming as i thought but comment let me know should i pull the mirrors down or leave them at the same height okay guys so here are the little nightstands so these are 26 inches tall so they're actually not that tall i was debating if i wanted to bring the mirror down but i feel like honestly if i don't it will still be fine let me know what you guys think but i was thinking about bringing it down just a little bit um just to kind of match but other than that um, as long as the um, table comes a little higher than my board, then that's fine. Um, so that's fine for now. Um, because like I said, it, you know, it is higher. So I'm able to still have a nice little length. So it just kind of flows. But I'm thinking if I want to bring this mirror down just a little bit. But yeah, the side dressers are absolutely gorgeous though. Let me know what you guys think. Like I said, it did come from the at-home store really nice they do have a pull out drawer right here to put stuff in and then it has like this knob on it which i didn't know how i felt about it at first 
I still don't know but yeah that's how it looks though like I said I was thinking about bringing the uh, mirror down just a little bit if I do it'll be fine if I don't it'll still be fine but I was thinking about it let me know what you guys think then of course it has a mirror at the top but they don't look as cheesy as I thought they would look they actually don't look that bad so I'm glad for that because <laughs> I just did not want it to look super cheesy so right now I do like how it is looking and as you guys see you can guys can still see the other one on the other side so I like that as well and yeah so the other side which if it just right like if it was any bigger literally if it was any bigger it wouldn't have fit so I measured it pretty good these are 18 inches these are 18.9 inches in width and 26 inches almost 27 in height so that's how this side is looking with this and as you see it still, has, it still has like a little bit of room on the side as well so that's how this side looks what i did to this curtain right here i meant to show you guys so i basically because remember i was saying like i feel like the window was just like i wish the window came over some so this is what i did so what I did was I ended up extending the rod and I ended up putting the rod more over here. So it looks like the window is like over here some. I'm going to scoot this back here. But as you guys can see, I put the panel like right there and it looked like the window was bigger than what it is. So I think that looks a lot better than just having them all scooted close to where the window stops at. So let me know what you guys think about that. But yeah, guys, so far this is how... Everything is looking so far. Loving everything. Loving how everything is turning out so far. I still have not found the shelf for this area. Both of these were on sale, so I got them on clearance. Originally they were 150, and then I got them on clearance for 112 a piece. So that was a pretty good deal. And this is how it looks on each side. And I'm loving the new addition. Because to me, if I feel like if I pull it down some, it'll kind of make the mirror look like, you know, a little taller. Or probably not. I don't know. But yeah, I was thinking about bringing it down some. But let me know what you guys think. morning guys how are you i wanted to actually show you guys how the room is looking with my lamps that i put in there so i did take the lamps out of the living room that i ended up getting from home goods and i ended up putting them in the room just to see how they look they actually kind of elevated the nightstands and they actually just added a really nice touch so i did want to show you guys how it actually looks this morning and also just how the room looks during the day so we're going to go ahead and do like a little mini tour of how the room look with the new mirrored nightstands. Okay guys, so this is how everything is looking right now during the day. I just thought you guys could probably get a better look during the day. Because I just feel like you can see everything better. So, this is how it looks. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous. I do love the side dressers now. Comment, let me know what you guys think. 
and like I said this is how they look close up they still need to be cleaned but so far guys like aren't they so luxe like they look so good I'm really glad that I got these now because they look absolutely gorgeous I think I did a good job by just putting these together with the mirror then the curtains look gorgeous okay this is how the other one looks so these are the lamps that i was telling you guys about that i end up getting from home goods if you have not seen them already i got them from home goods and i believe they were 40 dollars but these are how they look very gorgeous and it came from home goods and i got them in a set these lamps definitely elevate this space and definitely just brings that added luxury touch to the room as well the white is just given for me so yeah comment let me know I still think I want a new rug I just don't know where I want to get it from but comment some suggestions and let me know what you guys think but so far this is how it looks from this view and if you didn't know, I do have chrome legs on this bed as well. But this view right here just really just shows a nice view of everything. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about the mirrors and the new mirror nightstands. How are you guys liking everything so far y'all i really like the nightstands um i just think they add that touch that i needed to actually like you know go well with my mirrors that's above it and then also for the bed like i just think that they just look really good so comment let me know you guys honest opinion about what you guys think do you guys think i should bring the mirrors down some because now today that i'm looking at it i don't think i should bring them down anymore i think they look good the way that they are but I can bring it down a little bit. Some people leave theirs up a little bit with like a gap in between. And then some people bring them down. But I think I really like them how they are. I did get them from the at-home store. Comment below. Do you guys shop at the at-home store? And have you guys ever got some um, nightstands or dressers or any type of home decor furniture from there as well? It's my first time getting like some nightstands from there. So, so far, I might go back because I feel like the quality is really good. And it don't look as cheap as I thought it would. The original price was $140 for the nightstands. And... They were on clearance, so I did end up getting them for $112 a piece, which was a really good deal. Mirrors are just very expensive, especially mirrored nightstands. So I think that was a pretty good deal because on Wayfair, I'm sure they went up about starting at like $159, maybe $175 a piece. So I think I did pretty good. I think everything came to like $240, something like that. Yeah, I love how they look. Comment, have you guys ever ate at the Cheesecake Factory or do you have one in your city? And if you do... What do you guys normally order off the menu? Because y'all, the menu was so big, I didn't know what to get. But comment, let me know. The food was really good and the experience was really nice. And then also let me know, did you guys go to dinner or anything for New Year's with your husband, your partner, or anything like that, or your family member? So let me know in the comments, what did you guys do for New Year's Day 2020? It's just so crazy how it's the new year. What do you guys think about my Goodwill finds that I found in today's vlog as far as blazers? Did you guys like them? Um, I think they turned out really cute. I really got some really good... Um, quality pieces from there so I'm really glad that I was able to snag those I just feel like this year is gonna be a really good year I'm super excited to bring you guys new content and stuff like that so also let me know what do you guys think about my outfit of today with the gray sweater and the leggings and my little boots like I really love those boots from Target they're really cute do you guys cook breakfast or like a brunch type of vibe in the morning do you guys eat cinnamon rolls or like do you guys kind of cook a breakfast kind of like how Maz was or similar last but not least let me know overall what do you guys think about the bedroom in general are you guys liking how i extended the window on the right side of the room to make it look bigger like i just love how i'm just kind of learning like more like little tips and tricks about you know making things look more luxe and just kind of like evolving i just appreciate the growth that um i've been growing 
on my platform and just showing you guys you know things that i've learned too as well so i just want to say i love you guys happy new year's and comment below let me know what you guys thought about the overall blog and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys mm -hmm.